Hi, my name is Andreas Hense and today I want to talk about the work item life cycle. First of all, what is a work item? A work item is the instantiation of a task in a specific case. So if we have a workflow consisting of a sequence of tasks, then one of the tasks, for example, check personal data somewhere in the middle, is instantiated in a case and this is called work item. And work items go through different stages before being completed and this is called the work item life cycle. So the life cycle starts with the status created. A work item is created by the workflow engine and then the administrator or the system automatically offers it to several resources based on roles for example. And then these several resources can see the work item and one of them can decide to pick it up and accept the work item and then the work item goes into the status assigned. And then when it is assigned it can next go to the status started. When the participant actually opens the work item then the data are transferred to the work item and then work on the work item begins filling out the fields etc etc. Then the work item can also be suspended, for example, in rare cases and can be reactivated or it can be directly completed. Another more rare status for a work item is to be failed. So this is something for exception handling, for example. So this concludes the work item lifecycle. Thank you for watching.